What's up YouTube? Have you ever wanted to get a professional design suite for 50% off? Well, that's what we're here to talk about today with Affinity's move last week to slash their prices by 50% in order to help out creatives during the pandemic. And even if you already own the programs, there might be something here for you at the end as well. Okay, so you might remember back in March, at the very beginning of kind of the shutdown and things here in the US, Affinity went 50% off on their programs and started offering a three month free trial. And I made a video way back then about it. Of course, eventually after several months, that offer had to end because Affinity has to be able to make money on their software or they can't continue to develop it. So they couldn't be 50% off forever. But let me be clear here, even at full price, Affinity software is still a steal of a deal because you get the program and you aren't locked into a subscription model like you are when you're using Adobe software. But just this last Tuesday, they announced that they were going back to the 50% off because they said the impact of the pandemic is still significant on creatives. And so they're going back to the 50% off and the three month free trial so that you can be able to do the work you need to do during the pandemic. And I really think this is an admirable thing for Affinity to do. So let's go ahead and let's take a look at the deal and see how it might be able to help you out. First off, let's talk about the three month free trial. This is really big because to get 90 days with the software really gives you a chance to see what it's like to work with it full time. Adobe only gives you seven days with their software. Seven days is pretty much nothing to be able to figure out how your workflow is going to go. But Affinity has always given you 30 days and now they're going ahead and they're giving you 90 days. And what this does is even if you feel like you can't like leave Adobe permanently, but you don't have the money to pay for that subscription right now, maybe you're hurting because of the pandemic, you've lost work or a job, or you have some unexpected medical bills, or something like that, you can go ahead and you can still do your creative work using the Affinity programs for three months for free. And the amazing thing is they're even letting you use them for three months for free if you've already done the free trial in the past, which is incredible because normally these free trials are only for new customers, people who haven't done it before. But Affinity saying, okay, we don't care if you've done it before, you can do it again, which if you did it the last time and then you did it now, you'd basically be getting six months in a year free from them, which is crazy. I also think this is a great opportunity for college students to be able to take this three month free trial. Maybe they don't know if they can afford to pay for the programs outright right now. So they take this three month free trial. Maybe they were using Adobe before, but now they can't afford to pay even Adobe's student prices. And so they say, okay, for three months I can use Affinity for free. That would get you most of the way through this next semester if you were working on projects for school. You could even front load a bunch of your projects and get all of your work for the semester done while you're in this three month free window. So I'm really excited for a lot of you who can take advantage of these free three months, try out Affinity and maybe it works for you, maybe it doesn't, maybe it does work for you for a while but it's not something you wanna to switch to permanently but it really gives you a chance to dive in there and try it out and really see how it's gonna fit with your workflow. Now, as awesome as three free months with a program is, it gets even better because you do get 50% off if you choose to buy the Affinity programs right now. And so what was $50, which was each of the apps on desktop, is now only $25. $25 for a fully fledged program to do your design or your photography or your publishing work in. That's just incredible. And you can get the entire suite for $75. So for $75, you can be completely set up with a professional design suite, be able to do all of your professional design work right there in the Affinity programs. And such a great gesture on Affinity's part to help creatives out this way by charging them so little for these really robust and amazing programs. If you also think this deal is crazy good, go ahead and drop in the comments and let me know how excited you are about it. I just think it's crazy. And if you buy all three programs, of course you'll get access to my favorite feature, which is Studio Link that linking between the programs that makes working in Affinity so much better than working in any other design programs. Now real quick, let's talk about the iPad apps. Now the iPad apps are also 50% off, which makes them just $10 right now. $10 for a full-fledged design program on the iPad. So you can get both Affinity Photo and Affinity Designer on the iPad. There is no Affinity Publisher for the iPad right now, but you can get Affinity Designer or Affinity Photo for just $10, or you can of course pick up both of them for a total of $20, which is crazy. These are the best, hands down, 
the best design apps on the iPad. They are way better than Adobe's iPad apps, which have really, really struggled. Uh, Illustrator is a little bit better than Photoshop. Photoshop is just complete garbage, as you might have seen in my other videos. But Illustrator still is not fully featured like a fame designer is. So for $10, that's just crazy. Now there is no free trial because they has to run through the app store so they can't really offer a free trial without changing the way the program works to offer in-app purchases and stuff. And so it's just $10, but for 20 bucks, you can be all set up on the iPad. And I really think that regardless of what you're doing, regardless of if you are sticking with Adobe or you're switching to Affinity on desktop or whatever, for 20 bucks, you should just dive in and get these programs on the iPad so that if you need to work on your iPad, you can. I love working on my iPad in these programs. They are such great ways to do design by working on the iPad. So go ahead and make sure you check those out for sure. There's one other important thing to bring up right now, and that is that the Affinity programs are optimized for M1 Macs. So if you got a new MacBook Air, Mac Mini, or MacBook Pro with the M1 chips inside it, you might have found out that Adobe programs are not optimized for the M1 chip, so you might not be able to run them. Now you might have seen my videos where I showed that Adobe programs were running well for me on an M1 MacBook Air, but lots of people on those videos have commented that they are not running well for them because those programs have not been built to run on M1. Now the Affinity programs are already native for M1. So even let's say you're using Adobe right now and you don't have a price problem, this is a great opportunity for you if you have an M1 computer to get some design programs that will actually work reliably on your machine. We have no idea when Adobe will actually release the new versions of their programs to run on M1. And the M1 chips offer such huge performance gains. And of course there will be new Macs with Apple Silicon coming out this year. So it might be a great time to just invest in that single purchase license for the Affinity programs so that you know you will always have design programs that can run on an Apple Silicon Mac even if you don't have one right now, but you might be getting one in the future and you don't know how Adobe is going to be responding to that. So I really think for anyone who has an M1 or is thinking about getting an Apple Silicon chip in the future, now's the time to go ahead and buy Affinity while it's 50% off, save yourself a bunch of money, and then you can just get right into your design work without having to worry about the problems that come with Adobe. Okay, I told you guys who already own the Affinity programs that there might be something here for you as well, and this is it. The Affinity store is 50% off for all of the content that is there. So in addition to selling the applications where you can do the design work, I also sell a bunch of different content packages. So these are things like brush packs, textures, fonts, things that you can use in your design work, and they are all 50% off right now so make sure you go ahead and check out what's in the store and see if there's anything that you'd like to pick up for 50% off there again remember I don't have any affiliation with affinity I just think this is a great opportunity for a lot of designers to pick up great programs at a steeply discounted price so that's why I'm telling you about it in addition remember that I offer some courses on these programs so you can drop into the description of this video and look at the links to my courses which are over on Skillshare and you can take those Skillshare is a two-week free trial so you can take them without even spending any money and that can really help you learn some of these new programs if you're hesitant about trying to dive in and learn how to use these programs that can really help you out I especially have a bunch of programs for the iPad version of these apps which I know can be a little confusing at first when you're first switching to working on the iPad so go ahead and check those out all right I hope this video has been helpful to you please let me know what you think about the affinity programs going 50 percent off in the comments and give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel we'll chat in the comments and i will see you in the next video